What's going on YouTube? Just helping you out here. And for today's video, I'll be doing chapter 16, problem 1 in the Fundamentals of Physics textbook by Gerald Walker, Halliday, Res Halliday and Resnick, 8th edition. Chapter 16 is all about waves. And uh, in question 1, we are asked to find the angular wave number and the speed of a wave given its angular frequency and its wavelength. So for part A, you have to find the angular wave number, which is denoted by the variable k. And one of our fundamental equations is k equals 2 pi over wavelength. And we are actually given the wavelength, so we can directly plug that in. 2 pi over 1.8 meters, and that should give you 3.49 meters to the negative 1. And now for part B, we are asked to find the speed of the wave. And another one of our fundamental equations is velocity equals wavelength times frequency. And unfortunately, we aren't given the frequency. So we need to expand that a little further because we're given the angular frequency. So we can expand that to wavelength times omega over 2 pi because frequency is equal to omega over 2 pi. And since we're given angular frequency, um, this expanded form has your angular frequency, which is omega. So it works out. And we have all these variables now, so we can plug them in. We have 1.8 meters times 110 radians per second, all over 2 pi. And when you plug that in, you should get 31.5 meters per second. So that's it for this wave problem. If you liked the video, please drop a like. If you found the video helpful, please drop a like. Leave a comment if you have an idea for a future video or a question about something I did. And lastly, help me out by subscribing. I'm just helping you out. See you in the next video.